Hey everybody, it's Dean here and I am going to do another LinkedIn tips video with some help on how you uh, master your profile to get the right people looking at you. You draw the right decision makers, the right prospects to your profile. And whether you're a salesperson, a marketer or a business owner, whether you're in professional services, whether you're a coach, whether you're a creative, whether you're an accountant, uh, these key things will help you and this is a series of videos that you can plug into get some information and get started and if you want more information you can connect with me please follow me on LinkedIn I'm full so I can't add any more connections but please follow me because I'll share more stuff on there too and also subscribe to the channel because uh, you'll get more videos and they'll get in your feed and you won't miss a trick so we're going to look at your headline today and before you switch off and go oh my I don't care about headlines uh, headlines really do matter on LinkedIn and uh, they have the potential to put you in front of and to get you engaged with some of the key people in your market who can buy from you so we're going to look at it short and sweet and I'll tell you how this thing works so here's my headline so uh, my, I've got my profile picture, my name, and my headline here, which is, I can teach you to attract sales. And then I've got keywords, marketing, sales, LinkedIn, conference speaker, trainer, and consultant. So I've filled my uh, headline here with some great keywords that are relevant to the things I do. So I help people uh, with sales, I help people with marketing, I help people with LinkedIn, I speak at conferences and events, I train people and I consult with companies. So there's, I've really tried to cover the keywords that people would want to find and would be relevant. And then my, uh, you notice my job title isn't here at all. There's not enough space for my job title. So it's really for me about communicating the value I can deliver to the people who are interested in the keywords that I put on my profile. So I can teach you how to attract sales. That adds curiosity, it adds interest, and it doesn't just say I'm the CEO of Maverick or the MD of Exco. It really gives some interest into what I do. Now, first things first, there are three things about your LinkedIn profile that follow you no matter what you do on LinkedIn. The first one is your name. Your name goes everywhere you go. The second thing is your profile picture. Your profile picture follows you everywhere you go. And there's another video I'll do about the profile picture so that you don't waste any time, but you get the best outcome from your profile picture. So the headline is the third thing that follows you. And if you write a message, if you do a post, if you comment, if you like something, all of that stuff starts to follow you. The headline is the only thing that goes with your picture. So your headline really does matter. More so than all the other waffle on your profile, the headline is key because people will see that everywhere you go. So you need to spend a bit of time thinking about how can I concisely share the value I can bring and what are the keywords that matter to my customers. And that's what will go in your headline. That's what is, what's got to go there. Now, if you have a sales related title, yeah, one really important thing, nobody likes connecting with salespeople other than people who want to sell to salespeople. So I don't mind connecting with salespeople, but if you're a business owner, or a, you know, you probably dread the thought of being connect, uh, getting a connection request from a salesperson because you know what's going to follow, you're going to be pitched. So think about removing that title and just putting the value you deliver. I don't advocate cold pitching to people or pushy pitching. Uh, but uh, salespeople, people, people, even if you follow all of our training, that title in your headline will put people off. So deliver the value, show the value, put that in your headline. If you do that, by the way, you will see a massive change in who is finding you on the search features of LinkedIn. So based on the, your profile, LinkedIn will put you into searches that other people are looking for. And if you change your headline, you will change you, you will literally change who finds you. And most people don't do this, they don't get this. So I'm gonna put in here, if I go into my search appearances, and this is updated weekly, so I've had 1,042 people see my uh, profile picture, my name, and my headline in the search features. 
and these are where they work obviously maverick is my company so that's hands down that's going to happen uh, but then you've got four other companies and every week this will be different and LinkedIn just gives you a snapshot It's not really kind of anything scientific, but it gives you an indication are the right companies looking now for me It's b2b businesses. Uh, I don't really get involved in b2c I uh, have some custom projects, but not really so everything I'm looking at is b2b so these pit fit perfectly for me and then I look down here and I can see a selection of the titles of the people who are looking so again these titles here are really great for me. And then as I scroll down again, I can see the keywords that people have put in and how I'm being found. So again, these keywords are great for me. Uh, I could probably improve them. So every couple of weeks, I tweak my headline and see what happens. Tweak, see what happens. Tweak, see what happens. Um, but it really does work and it really does make a difference. And literally, you can track and change your profile, change your header, and you will see a change in the people finding you on LinkedIn. So your headline is not just your shop front. It's not just about giving, showing people the value you can deliver. It is a magnet that will help people find you. So invest a little bit of time in your headline, and you will really will, really will reap the rewards. Thanks for watching this. If you've enjoyed this video, if you've got some value from it, subscribe to the channel, follow me on LinkedIn, come find me on LinkedIn, follow me there and I'll be sharing more stuff that will help you attract more clients from LinkedIn.